Yes, absolutely. I think this 13 ODI is that we're going to play before the World Cup. Uh, you know, more or less, you will see the same squad playing in the World Cup. There will be one or two changes. Uh, uh, you know, keeping in mind uh, the form and injury concerns uh, over the, over this next uh, few months. Um, we played a lot of cricket throughout the year, so uh, the injuries are bound to happen, and there will be some concerns about form and fitness, but. I don't see uh, there will be any drastic change in the squad. Um, honestly, looking at you know the slots, more or less, I think you know the slots are pretty much you know uh, taken by individuals. But having said that, I feel I still feel you know uh, everything will depend on the form of each player. I think uh, nobody is guaranteed uh, that flight to England uh, as yet. We got to be in prime form each and. Uh, every player that will be, uh, you know, uh, taking part in that World Cup. I think it is very important, not just for the top three, but all the six, seven batters that will be playing. Uh, it is important because I, I always believe that it's not about one or two individuals. It's about, you know, eleven of us going and contributing there. So, not eleven of us, seven, seven or eight batters that will be playing. I think it's important to contribute uh, in whatever they, whatever way they can. uh individuals probably will win you one or two games but if you want to win the championship uh i think all the batting unit needs to come together and and, and at some stage they need to put their hand up and say okay i'm going to take that challenge and uh you know make my uh, make the team get through the finishing line uh, uh our middle order definitely believes in you know going out there and taking the challenge uh because it's not about the top order or the middle order it's about the whole batting unit uh, the batting group that we have and uh, it's all of us know that uh, you know come whatever uh, situation we we got to put our hand up and make sure that you know we get the finish get through the finishing line um we saw raidu coming uh, pretty good in the last series we played in india dinesh has done reasonably well and then uh, ms obviously you know is a key factor uh, going forward and then there is kedar who you know brings so much to the table with his bowling and uh, with his uh, ability to strike the ball at the end so uh, all these guys are very very important and not to forget hardik and jadeja who will be playing a crucial role with the bat you know uh, that finishing touch is very very important in this format so i think all these batters will have important role to play Yeah, of course. See, a lot of the guys are now used to it. Uh, they know uh, after you got to switch format uh, quite quickly, and uh, these days we play all three formats uh, on the same tour. So, and a lot of the guys uh, are are specially uh, playing guys who are playing for lim- uh, guys who are playing limited overs. They know. I mean, they they got to you know switch on from day one as soon as they arrive in the country. Uh, but by now, I think most of the guys are used to it. Uh, switching formats earlier when it started back to back formats it was slightly tough but i don't think it's an issue right now yeah of course that's that's without a doubt i, I you know over the years uh you've uh, we've we've seen what what sort of uh, uh presence he has uh, in the dressing room and on the field uh, you know with him being around there's a sense of calmness around the group which is very important i think uh, and also uh, a bit of help as well uh, uh, to the captain you know uh, look because he stands behind the stump and you know he is captain india for so many years and he's been such a successful captain for india uh, so him uh, being around uh, with the team always uh, is helpful and uh, yes he's like a guiding light i would say uh, around the group and i think uh, uh, also with the bat uh, going batting down the order uh, getting us uh, through the line that finishing touch is very very important see if i look at it uh, these three guys uh, they don't play too much of odi cricket if i'm not wrong uh, the last time we came here none of these guys played and we were still beaten uh, 4-1 it was that yeah i think it was 4-1 so they still have quality in their bowling it's not that they don't uh, of course they those three are their premier bowlers but uh they've got the guys who can do the job for them and they can their bowling lineup can put us under pressure without a doubt 
because i've been watching they've been playing some uh, you know limited overs cricket uh, and they've been doing well so it's not going to be uh, you know an easy uh, walk over situation for us we got to grind it out there uh, face the challenge and uh, make sure that we put them under pressure uh, of course the team is high on confidence right now so we got to carry that into this format as well and make sure that we keep doing the right things and we keep doing the little things right uh, because looking at the larger picture right now is not uh, something that we are looking at we we got to focus on the small things make sure that we go home uh, go to new zealand from here with high in confidence uh, uh, doing well in all formats we drew the t20 so, uh, series we won the test series now time for us to make sure that we win this uh, odi series as well as well and go to new zealand